This time there's more at stake than a sprinkling of small change. Street musicians in Madrid now need a permit to perform and the city council is holding auditions. It's a performance that matters. Employment in Spain is at 26%. We live with what we make on the streets and the band finances itself with that and the money from gigs. Hundreds of musicians from all over the country wait their turn. Outside the Conde Duque Cultural Center, flamenco singer Eva Montoya from Seville has a last-minute rehearsal. Inside, she'll have just five minutes to impress a three-member panel. If you can't make a living, you have to do whatever comes your way. One likes to perform, show the public what one is worth, because in this world, that is everything. The city council wants to control noise levels. They also hope to improve the quality of street music. But for some, this misses the point. For many, playing in the street is an alternative to begging. It makes no sense to evaluate it artistically when we are speaking about charity. An eclectic range of styles on display during the three days of auditions and opinions just as diverse. This is OK, because they will give us permission to play, and now we won't have any trouble with the authorities. Street musicians without permits will be fined and moved on by the police, and those with permission to play will be asked to halt the music for two hours during the afternoon siesta. Emily Thomas, BBC News.